Hey, what's going on? You know who it is. You know what it is. All right, guys, people. For those who was wondering what was going on with the Coming to America sequel, which was supposed to make its debut on Amazon Prime in December, it appears that the movie has been pushed back to March of 2021, which isn't out of the ordinary. Lots of movies have been pushed back to 2021. From the sequel to The Fast and Furious to the new version of Saw starring Chris Rock. So a lot of movies had just a lot of movies have been pushed back. Black Widow has been pushed back. So uh, Matrix 4 has been pushed back. So basically, depending on what happens next year, how soon they can get this virus out and whatever the case may be, um, Movies that was supposed to come out in 2021 is going to get pushed back to 2022. So you just thinking based off all the movies that was pushed back, you know, uh, A Quiet Place 2, just quite a few movies. Then there are going to be some movies that's just going to go directly to uh, pay-per-view on TV. They may go the direction of Mulan. Now, keep in mind. They announced that Wonder Woman 1984 will be available for home viewing and theatrical viewing. I think it opens on Christmas, if I'm not mistaken. So it's either or. Now, with that being said, let's get back to the sequel to Coming to America. Now, a lot of people were upset, including the cast of the movie, one of the people that was in the movie that's set to be featured in the movie was Michael Blackston. And he said he's not going to lie. He's bummed that the movie is not going to play in theaters. But he said he understand. But, you know, at the end of the day, I'm a little bummed too because I do like the essence of going to the movie theater to watch certain movies. I had a chance to go watch uh, the slasher film um, Freaky with Vince Vaughn and mm, yeah but nevertheless nevertheless um it this is you know it is what it is i kind of figure something was going on because i was like well damn this movie is set to debut and like a month and still no trailer has been released so you kind of figure that probably was the case that was going on but that's okay. Um, you know, it is what it is. Now, keep in mind, Amazon has not ruled out having a short the theatrical run for this movie. They said that they could possibly do like a short theatrical run, maybe a two-week theatrical run. Sort of like what they did with uh, what Netflix did with Dolomite is My Name. Keep in mind, I saw that at the movie theater, and the funny thing was, it was only in theaters for like two weeks, and when I went to see it at the movie theater, it had a nice uh, crowd, so it kind of make you think, well, damn, if they had put this at the movie theater, who, who knows what would have happened, but you know, Netflix really specialized in home viewing, but that's something that they should consider, you know, but nevertheless... You know, nevertheless, Coming to America 2, the sequel is called Coming to America, Coming to with the numeral 2, will once again be released in March of 2021. This your boy Town Biz. I'm out.